the NBN Access Network is coming to your home. Here's what you need to do to prepare for your NBN installation day. By now, you'll have arranged to switch to an NBN powered plan with an internet service provider and booked your NBN installation with them. You'll be notified of your appointment window via SMS and will need to reply to confirm. You'll also receive a call a few days prior to your appointment to make sure everything is set for installation day. Each installation is different. It could only take up to two hours, but more complex installations could take longer. NVN doesn't charge for a standard installation, but a more complex installation could come at some cost to you. Someone over 18 must be present on the day to make decisions about your NVN installation. It's important to know that equipment connected to the NVN access network won't work during a power outage but you'll have the option to keep your existing copper phone line active for emergency communications. Now is also the time to think about where in your home the NBN supplied equipment will be installed. Consider things like what room you use most of your devices in, where power outlets are located, and whether blinking lights might be distracting. For help with this, you can speak to your internet service provider before the installation. Your NVN approved technician can also offer guidance on the day and they'll bring all the equipment needed to complete your NVN installation. Additional equipment like a modem and ethernet cables are supplied by you or your internet service provider. They may need to drill a hole in your wall. So if you are renting your home, make sure you ask your landlord for permission. Your NVN approved technician will then install an NVN satellite dish on your roof in a suitable location. Before they leave, your technician will make sure the NBN connection box is installed on a suitable wall and that your equipment is ready to connect to the NBN access network when your service becomes active. You may need to wait 24 hours for this. You'll then be able to connect to the internet yourself by connecting the NBN connection box to your modem with an ethernet cable. You should ensure the space around the equipment is kept clear and avoid covering or blocking it with furniture or a TV. You can then plug your NVN compatible phone directly into your modem, as well as gaming consoles, pay TV set-top boxes and streaming devices. This should help you get more from your internet experience. For more tips, go to nbn.com.au slash optimization. You're now officially connected to the internet. After the day, it's important to remember these two things. One, if you need any support with your NBN installation or service, contact your internet service provider first. They should be able to help. And two, when you move, the NBN supplied equipment stays where it is. It will only work at this location. Now you know everything you need to connect to the internet over the NBN access network.